fun day. And no, I am not sick. It's just very much hay fever season. So I'm sick of the fact that I'm allergic to the grass that I cut to make hay. But I'm, allergic. I'm just allergic to the whole thing. Yeah, I keep doing it. Fun times. And <laughs> uh, we came to check the sheep last night. We met Rob well, after work. We met him here. It's my husband for those who don't know. And the three of us tried to check this absolute bedlam. So I'm kind of glad I didn't film it because at one point I was having to tell Isaac that he couldn't put a toy pig in his mouth. And then Rob was telling me how to climb out the magnesium bucket. One of those kind of evenings. But anyway, it's Monday. It's cloudy. It's overcast. The rain now might come today, might come tomorrow. Who actually knows? Um, but <sighs> got to try and get everything sorted so we can cut some hay because it's supposed to be good from Wednesday on. Got to get a hay cut, guys. Got to get it cut. And got to get these girls sorted. Look, come and look at these. Absolute state, a lot of them. This one's on her own again. The plus side, I don't think it's Gertie. Because recently Gertie's been on her own all the time. Yeah, that's not dirty, I can tell from the back side. But whoever it is is starting to get a bit of a little mini bag, maybe? Hmm, mini bag. Right, let's check on Gertie. There's Gertie, the one ahead. Oh, goodness, her absolute state. Look at her. Does anyone know what that black stuff is underneath her? Did she just sit in something? We've got Sally, the idiot, who's missing 6,000 ear tags. Whip them out on fences. It's a good job I've got your number, Sal's, isn't it? Oh, so yes, half of them are limping. They're an absolute state. But we're gonna fix it, aren't we, mate? We're gonna fix it. What are you doing? Goodness gracious. Um, but yeah, they all look okay considering the fact that they don't, if you know what I mean. And we will get them sorted. It's, I've seriously no idea what that just looks minging. Gertie, seriously, love. Like your whole back leg is, yeah. I'm gonna get a sorted, I'm gonna get her sorted. I'm gonna get, oh good, yeah, I need to check her teats. We're just, we're just gonna give them all like a bit of an MOT. But first I have to go and find my child. It was disappearing into the grass. What are we gonna do with you lot, hey? Get them sorted, are we, gonna do we, gonna do? we are going to get them sorted. We're gonna plan for this week, just so you know what's coming. Get the girls sorted, plan number one. Cut some hay. Plan number two, which sounds like a really simple plan. So many steps, so many steps are involved in those that it's a little bit insane. But those are the two plans and I'm gonna, oh, seriously Gertie, oh love. Uh, we are gonna get that all sorted this week. So please do stick around to see it. I'll see you later. Girlies, good evening. I have excellent news for tomorrow. You get a pedicure, and you get a pedicure, and you get a and you all get fly strike treatment. And you, Sally, wherever you are at, get your ear looked at, sorted out. Yeah, you there in the middle, 6,000 ear tags missing. I mean, she only has one, but it's the second time she's ripped her ear tag out. I am going to run out of places to tag on that girl, I'm not gonna lie. Um, what are you guys doing over here? In the beautiful sunshine. Oh, that's something out of a picture book. But yeah, we will be doing uh, foot trimming, fly strike treatment, uh, general well-being checks. Gertie will have more wound cream applied to the side and Sally will have her ear checked. And I'll work out where on earth I'm going to get a site for a new tag in because she's already had one at the front and one at the back. And I'm just, she just rips them out for funsies now. This is your second. Great. Uh, <laughs> right now, I'm going to take these girls over for tonight and then, yeah, go from there. Uh, will you two stop it? Hello, Joe. <clears throat> oh, sorry, girls. Oh, lots and lots of beans for dinner. I do love good beans.
Yeah, some of them have enlarged teats. But to be fair, the one that's really bad on, she was really bad last year as well. And she didn't get mastitis, she just had teats that size. <laughs> Love the lambs jumping. She just has teats that size and that shape. But I will still check her over just to be on the safe side. Um, so to do that, I just check for any lumps or bumps in her udder. Hello, my lovely lamb. I make sure she's all good. Considering they all need their feet doing, they're walking a lot better than they should be if you saw their feet. Like, their feet are minging. Desperately need to get them done. But that is tomorrow's job. Oh, lovely. Just stop for a wee. And, yeah. Just keep them covered at the moment with fly strike treatment. <laughs> and enjoy watching a bunch of lambs bounce around the field. Because it's just fun, isn't it? But, yeah. Tomorrow... Tomorrow you will all go on a trailer. And for the lambs, it will be their first time on a trailer. And of course, Gertie was down there by herself. So I'm now going to go check Gertie. And then I'll probably call it a night. Gertie is not alright. I don't really know what's wrong with her. Apart from the fact she really needs her feet doing. And I'll just keep massively covering her for fly strike. Where she, that skin is struggling. But yeah. Side note, yesterday I found a dead magpie here. You can just see its feathers left. Now, I know it's one for sorrow, two for joy. But if the magpie is already dead, like, does that absolve the sorrow? Was it its own sorrow? Who knows? Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. And yes, I look rough as I'm having all sorts of hay fever issues going on. Um, oh, and Isaac wants to climb on my lap. Always helpful when you're in the middle of filming, isn't it, kid? Yeah, you just want to be right in here. Cool. Um, so we're getting the sheep done this morning. Um, I don't have as much fly strike treatment as I thought I had, so we're going to use it as a treatment rather than a preventative today. And I'm going to get some more and we'll use it as a preventative for all those who don't require treatment today in the next couple of weeks because they're not actually due for another week they should have another week's worth of protection on them oh isaac is just doing but isaac do not put sheep nuts in your snack pot anyone else anyone else have these issues in life um so yeah battling the grass pollen i am completely drugged up and this is still what i've got going on unfortunately the first sheep i've just put through the race because we are down doing their feet now and um, the first one i've just put through is gertie and she has unfortunately got fly strike on her underbelly. And on, you're not eating that. Um, sorry. And on her legs as well. So it's really quite bad. So I'm going to treat her. Um, I can't really show you much of what I'm doing today. Because of where we are. And because we're using equipment that's not ours. But I'll, um, yeah, I'll let you know how it goes. <laughs> Pray for me. Bye. Hey. We just got back to the car. I say got back to, like, I've literally parked next and stuff. Um, we got back to the car for lunch. Because girl needs to eat. We are about halfway through. So we've done four of the six lambs. They just need checking over. So that's the quickest one to go through. And we've done five of the ten girls. So they are obviously the longest to get through. Isaac, do not eat any sheep nuts. Another sentence says, I get to say it when I. Um... It's, been, it's not been great. So I'll put in a little clip of Gertie's fly strike. So as you can see, the maggots were so bad. I also had it all down one leg. So where she was limping a little bit is because it's because the maggots were eating her leg. So I've treated her. That's why I'm covered in I'm covered in everything. To be fair, right now, guys, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I've treated her Sally had a little bit underneath her belly So I've treated that as well Again, I don't think you need to see more pictures of maggots It's minging um, Henrietta, you know how we said she was limping? She had maggots between her toes mm. If anyone's wondering why they, I take so much joy In swatting flies Isaac, that is not designed for sheep nuts Apparently it's being used for it It's designed for water or sand Not sheep nuts, in my car uh, but yeah, if anyone's wondering why I take such joy in swatting flies, it's because that's what they've done to my sheep. And these are bits that, whilst we treated the fly strike, these are bits that you don't treat. So you spray along the back and along the back end, because that's where they most likely get it. 
No, mine have got it in their feet, their legs, and under their bellies. Great. Um, the rest of them that I've done, so the other two that I've done, haven't had fly strike. However, their feet have been atrocious. Um, and yeah, I think everyone's got purple feet. At one point, the wind changed because so I was spraying the purple spray. Please put the purple spray. So it's a bit of a bit of a one. We're going to have our lunch now and then we're going to get back at it and we're going to try and get the next five done plus the two lambs. And then we'll get them set up with some water because they're going to stay down here for the evening. But yeah. I might see if I can get some close-ups of some stuff. Also, um, I sprayed Sally's ear because obviously she ripped her ear tag out. So that's sorted now as well. I will order her a new ear tag. But yeah. I might be able to get some more close-ups of stuff. But yeah. Trust me. A lot of it is not things you want to see. Oh, okay, guys. We did it. Kind of. They're still in the pen rather than back in their field. But that's because I'm going to leave them there for the night and I'm going to move them tomorrow. But we did it. I was going to film a little bit of the last one I was doing. But that's when it started traffic down rain. Yes, buddy. I'll turn the TV off for you in a minute. Very tired. Need some cartoons. But yeah. I'm sorry I look like this as well. I don't know what I got in my eye. Possibly blue spray. I got blue spray everywhere. Yes, buddy, there is the remote. And like blood and cheap mark and grass stains and cyphermethrin and all the lovely things all up and down my arms. Also, I've started to write in welts from the grass because I'm like properly allergic to grass. It's great fun. So I'm going to put the cartoons on for the kid. I'm going to put the water on the arms. There we go. I'm going to put the drugs in the head. Life is going to be good. Um, I don't know if we're going to dance or not later. If we are, that will be now. Yeah. Well, after this anyway. If we're not, then I'll see you on Thursday. <laughs> I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> Looking slightly more human. Not a lot, but a little bit. Rob's just opened a can of drink next to me. Um, we're now in the rain. <laughs> God's 7 o'clock at night. We're going to Dad's house. <laughs> If this video comes out really, really late Tuesday or really early Wednesday, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying, I promise. Well, we're going to go fix the mower. Getting ready to put the last two on here and the last one on that one. Let's see if I can actually get them the right way around this time. Okay, so all these are done. These two are on. Just working on that last one over there, which gets a fancy cap because it's a different hat. So it can have the fancy bit on top, whereas these ones just get the plain bit of metal. Because that's all that fits. But we're almost there. Next problem, this is supposed to be on top of there. So we need to cut this out because, yeah, that plate needs to be on top, like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> this. Rob did it before I could even film. He's done. <laughs> Yeah, you're right. Hopefully the weather will be good soon and you can see it in action. We'll see if it actually works. So we are finally finished for the night. Today started at half past six and it is now like half past ten. So again, this might have to go on Wednesday morning. If it is Wednesday morning and you're just seeing this, I'm really sorry. I do try and get out on a Tuesday, but the night has been a long one. Can I breathe? No, no, I can't. But is the mower pretty much done? Yes. Yes? Looking for confirmation? Yeah, yeah. Enough. Enough that it will work. So come back Thursday to see if we actually get it working. Who knows? Yes.